let the battle begin! Welcome everyone to Hearts in Combat. I'm your host, Milan. Tonight, we have a magical showdown. Two incredible contestants ready to battle it out to win the game. Let's meet them now through our state-of-the-art hologram projector. student, but by night, I'm a teenage witch casting spells and saving the world. No big deal. Hello, everyone. I'm Wednesday Adams. I enjoy long walks in the cemetery, reading Edgar Allan Poe, and practicing my disapproving glare. Alright, contestants, let's dive into our first round of questions. First up, the theme is intellect. Sabrina, here's your question. If you could invent any spell to enhance your intelligence, what would it be called and what would it do? Great question, Mulan. I'd invent the Brain Boost Brew, one sip, and you'd instantly understand every subject from quantum physics to ancient history. Plus, it tastes like chocolate. Wednesday, same question to you. What would your intelligence-enhancing invention be? I'd create the knowledge noose. It tightens your understanding with every question you solve. But beware, it's not for the faint of heart. Perfect for unraveling the darkest mysteries. Fantastic answers. Now, let's switch to our next theme, love. Sabrina, if you could cast a love spell, what would it do and what's the secret ingredient? Oh, that's easy. My love spell, Cupid's Charm, would make people see the best in each other. The secret ingredient? A pinch of laughter, because love should always be fun. Wednesday, your turn. What would your love spell do, and what's its secret ingredient? My spell, Eternal Embrace, would bind two souls together forever. The secret ingredient is a single drop of midnight dew, collected under a full moon. Love should be eternal, don't you think? Wonderful. Now, for our final segment, we have a detective riddle. Each of you will give your answer, but you won't hear each other's response until after. Ready? Here's a detective riddle for you both. A man was found murdered on Sunday. The wife said she was sleeping. The cook was cooking breakfast. The gardener was planting seeds. The maid was getting the mail. And the butler was polishing the silverware. Who did it? I'd say the maid. There's no meal on Sundays. I concur. It's elementary. No one gets mail on Sundays. Unless, of course, it's a curse letter. You're both right. The maid did it because there's no mail on Sundays. Well done. Detectives. That's it for our third episode of Hearts in Combat. Who will win the game? Remember, you get to decide the winner. Stay tuned for more fun on Hearts in Combat. See you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. <laughs>